Hey guys, Sean from Living Seeds here. Today we're going to be talking about the Biopersimilis mite. This is a, a small little red mite and it lives its life eating spider mites. So it eats the four main um, red spider mite mites that we normally encounter in a vegetable garden or, or inside a tunnel. And these guys are they move really, really quickly, which is very cool. And I'm going to open this container for you shortly so that you can see what, well, hopefully we can, we can focus in and you can see what these mites look like. But very simply, um, a container like this contains 2,000 predatory mites, or at least 2,000 predatory mites. And very simply, what one does is you'd actually just unscrew the cap and you would walk through your infested plants and sprinkle the vermiculite that's inside here, which is the carrier. You'd sprinkle the vermiculite um, all over the infected plants and then basically what happens is these little persimilis mites go, they latch onto the red spider mite, literally um, insert their mouth parts and, and suck them dry. And um, they breed up twice as fast as red spider mites. So if you've got a population of red spider mites, um, these guys um, will breed up twice as fast as your red spider mites in your garden. So. This is a brinjal plant. This is a, a Prosperosa brinjal plant. And it's in our show garden. And if you have a look at these leaves, you can see that there's, there's tiny little um, yellow spots on the leaves. Now those yellow spots show us that the red spider mite are feeding on the underside of the leaf. And I'm pretty sure we're not going to be able to focus in, but I'm going to hold it nice and still so that my able camera assistant can focus in on the red spider mites. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to open this container and I don't know if you can see on the lip these tiny little red guys that are just charging around. These guys hatched about a day ago so they're hungry. They're really really hungry um, and, they, and they're looking for red spider mites to eat. So basically what we're going to do is we're just going to sprinkle some some persimilis mites or at least vermiculite which is the carrier onto the plants and we'll run through our garden like this um, and just sprinkle persimilis mites all over the garden inside the cap there are a couple of spider of, 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 of predatory mites so I'm just going to leave the cap in the garden as well and those mites will actually crawl off the cap and go and look for red spider mites guys that's it it's very simple to release the persimilis mites they work for you and uh, <laughs> I really dig these guys. You guys have a great day. Please sign up to our YouTube channel for more interesting videos like this. Thank you very much.